Today's random spot, look what we got. We got the accoutrements, Mr. Bacon versus Monsieur Tofu. Come on! Only one can remain the top of the food chain, bendable and lots of fun wherever fun is needed. You get yourself inside here, a bacon bendable figurine as well as a tofu figurine. Let the wager begin. Spot, where would you have picked up such a ridiculous item from? The answer, stupid.com. So I'm going to provide the link down below if you guys want to pick up one of these yourself. Um, on the side, look at the shenanigans going on up here. It says, come and get it. You're about to get served. Look at that bacon. He is not taking prisoners. Down here, uh, he's saying something, creve, viande, creve. I don't know what he's necessarily saying. Exclamation mark, though. Exclamation mark. On the other side, go away or I shall taunt you a second time. And then he's saying, bite me. Oh, bacon, you and your shenanigans. And then on the back, again, only one can remain at the top of the food chain. You're going down, soy boy. Not this time, you greasy punk. I, although, technically, I should give my French accent, but yes, it is Mr. Bacon versus Monsieur Tofu. Uh, what I am going to do, I know this review has already become ridiculous. Ridiculous level will actually increase after we come back because I'm going to take a break and get this opened up. When we come back, Mr. Bacon and Monsieur Tofu await. Stay tuned. So inside this pack, you'll actually get two bendable figurines. Each, obviously, a little bit different from the other one. For Monsieur, Bake, Monsieur Tofu, you get yourself a little square chunk of tofu. Complete with monocle, curled up mustache, flailing arms. The Monsieur Tofu. Oh la la, what are you doing? Ah! Um, all of them. No, it will get more ridiculous than that. All of them have bendable arms, as you can see right here. You can kind of rotate the arms, not really too much, but certainly you can bend them. You can't really do much with his body. His body is just basically a, a rubber piece, almost like a dog toy. Not that you should be giving tofu to a dog, plastic versions or real versions. Uh, his feet can rotate slightly, and of course you can bend the feet back and forth. So he could be running Oh, mamma mia. No, that, that's Italian. <laughs> Spot, that's Italian. Sacre bleu! Anyways, there's the Mosu Tofu. He needs a hat or something, like a little top hat. Or a cane. Am I stereotyped? Am I stereotyping the French that badly? Um, there's nothing on the bottom. They don't have base or anything like that. But, I mean, uh, he is of adequate size for something just being as ridiculous as this. On the back, it says accoutrements. Also tofu. On the other end of the scale, you have something that's not as healthy for you. You have Mr. Bacon. Mr. Bacon kind of looks like me. If I was a strip of bacon. I see the resemblance, though, if that was kind of somewhat spiky hair. He's got, of course, the same bendable arms. Same bendable legs. You can rotate them ever so slightly. You can get the arms, to, the legs to go out. Oh, what's going on? But you can rotate the legs. You could bend them as well. You could really bend the knee, I guess, if you wanted to as well. You could kind of, you know, if he's doing a jive or what have you. And I guess, to some extent, you could probably bend Mr. Bacon as well. If you want to really, if he could slip under the door. Hey, what's going on, Mr. Bacon here? You making bacon? No? You're my friend. Come here. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Um, what would really make this set that much cooler is weapons. Who's, who's on the same page as Spot? No? Weapons. I would totally give these guys maces, balls and ball and chains, uh, swords, daggers, rocket launchers, anything. I think on a waged war between these two, weapons would certainly make... It would be like Thunderdome. It would be food Thunderdome. Two pieces of food enter, one food leaves. But I think these are neat. I think these are neat. Fun little items. I think my choice really, I gotta, as much as I love crabby little French tofu guy here, really gotta go with Mr. Bacon. There's the back of him as well. Uh, 
you know what? If you guys want to let me don't know down below, I love your participation in all this. You guys can let me know down below who you think would win Mr. Bacon, Monsieur Tofu. You guys can let me know. Wage the war down below. Maybe it would be unanimous. Maybe it would be split down the middle. Some people would say, oh, Monsieur Tofu's totally got this win. He would just totally break a strip off of him. Ah, yeah, you see? No. Okay. But uh, these are really, really fun. If you like little bendable novelty things, and certainly love bacon, I mean, by all means, pick this set up. Today's random spot, a little shorter than normal, but we were having a look at the epic battle of Monsieur Tofu versus Mr. Bacon. If you want some ridiculousness yourself, definitely click the link down below. I'm going to provide the link to uh, stupid.com. As always, thank you guys for watching. Certainly stick around, there are more random spots heading your way. Hey, you guys really need weapons. Totally need weapons. But thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Ah, oh, sacre bleu!